CBS4 is giving you an exclusive look at technology keeping shoppers safe at Central Indiana shopping malls. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Debbie Knox. And I'm Bob Donaldson. It comes after several cases of gun violence at Indiana malls over the past year. CBS4's Russ McQuaid finding out tonight what it takes to protect shoppers. Good evening, Russ. And good evening, Bob. You know, in many communities, shopping malls are the equivalent of the traditional downtown where commerce is done and Americans meet. Well, sometimes, just like in the rest of society, malls can also be where crime occurs. Just a couple days after New Year's, two young men walked up to a car they thought was theirs in the parking lot of Castleton Square Mall, and another man inside opened fire. One person was killed, one was arrested. The shooting we had in this parking lot, all of that was captured on video. That helped lead our detectives to the facts and help us make an arrest in that case. It's a secondhand report. This is a rare look inside the Operations Intelligence Center in a back room at Castleton Square Mall. We have numerous security guards numerous police officers, smart cameras, surveillance systems. We have all the different programming in place to, to protect our people. And if a bad guy shows up, you know, we're going to see him. Besides typical mall security, there's a canine on site at Castleton Square trained to sniff out firearms and so far has sent dozens of people with guns back out to the parking lot where there is a security tower with cameras to watch shoppers' vehicles and prevent break-ins and robberies. All makes up the visible security that is the first line of defense in shopping safety. Within a particular property, we may have 10, 15 security guards, five, six, seven police officers, smart cameras watching the property with OIC operatives. Local police say Simon's security footprint extends beyond its parking lot. They put in four flock uh, license plate reader cameras, giving our officers access to them. So anytime a wanted vehicle, a wanted person associated with a vehicle, or a missing person, uh, anytime one of those pass those cameras, our officers are alerted. Simon Mall says that, of course, they have malls. There is crime everywhere in America, and they have stores and malls everywhere in America. So coming up tomorrow, we'll take you behind the scenes of Simon's security operations to give you a rare glimpse into the system that's keeping an eye on American shoppers from coast to coast. Bob and Debbie, as you know, Simon Malls, and they admitted this today. They say, we don't talk to anybody. They're talking to us. We'll take you inside tomorrow afternoon. We'll look forward to it, Russ. Thank you. Metro Police.